Hello and welcome to Can I Sharpen? Uh, today we're going to be sharpening this uh, three inch blade uh, from uh, knifewarehouse.co.uk. Um, you can see this and some of the knives that I got from them in my unboxing. Um, what we're going to do with this is we are going to um, we're going to uh, put a new edge on this because this knife is not sharp at all. Um, I can, couldn't cut myself if I wanted to. Um, so we're going to put an entirely new edge on it, uh, put it to uh, a 20 degree angle on it which is a working edge and then from there uh, we'll sharpen it up, polish it up using this KK Moon knife sharpening kit uh, and you should get a nice sharp uh, razor sharp edge on it. Um, so first thing we'll do is a quick paper test just to see how it cuts. So just an ordinary sheet of paper here, nothing too special. So it does have a little bit of cut to it but nothing fantastic. Let's just yeah, so it is quite sharp, but we can do a lot better. It's it's curling the edge, and it's making it so it's uh, quite uh, ruffled as well. I don't know if you can see that on there, uh, but yeah, we'll uh, we'll clean that up uh, and go from there. So I've preset this to uh, 20 degrees uh, to make it nice and easy for myself. So I'm going to work this knife uh, with the uh, 320 grit. Uh, and then from the, sorry, the 180 grit, uh, and we're going to get the, the knife down to a 20 degree angle. So you just lay the knife over the edge, and then just work in circles until you bind, grind that knife down. This is going to take a little bit of time, uh, grinding this knife down to this angle. Uh, so I will speed this up, uh, and then we'll come back to it once this has been ground down. Okay, so we're almost there. We've almost taken off all the blue off both sides. Uh, blue is off on this side, uh, which needs to work on this side a little bit more. So I'm just going to place it back under the uh, the edge uh, and just work on that a little bit further. Okay, as you can see, we've moved all the uh, the blue marker pen uh, from this blade, um, so that means we've got a new edge of a 20 degree angle. Um, so we can now work that angle uh, and make sure we keep it going as it's saying. So we're going to change the stone, uh, so we don't need this stone anymore. We're going to put another stone on it. This is the uh, the 320 grit, uh, and this is going to help us uh, just refine that angle just a little bit. Uh, and then from there, we can uh, we'll keep working through our stone levels, uh, to the grit levels, until we've got a, a nice shiny uh, new edge on our blade. You don't have to clip it each time if you don't want to, if you just want to sort of rely on your, your hand then that's fine, uh, but I, I'm going to keep clipping.
Okay, so that's coming out nicely. You can see, um, well, you might not be able to see on camera already, but it's already starting to uh, to, to polish up, and there's a nice burr on there uh, when we do the downstroke. So yeah, um, that's really good. That means the knife itself is getting sharper. Um, so we're going to put another stone on this. Uh, we're going to take this to the uh, to the the 600 grit. Uh, with this, we've got this start to get it nice and polished, uh, and we'll move it to a thousand grit once we're finished with that one. We're actually going to skip the uh, the, the 600 grit um, just because I don't think it needs it. We're going to take it straight to the, the, the finest of the stones uh, and then from there um, that knife should be uh, razor sharp. Um, should cut a lot cleaner than it did on the, on the paper a moment ago. So I'm just going to put this in place. Okay, so this is the, uh, the you see the 1000 or 1500, I can't remember, it might be 1500, um, if it is it just means we get a more polished edge, uh, and then from there we're going to test the knife, uh, just compare it to how it was before we started the sharpening. We'll make sure our, our angle is still the same, because it did slip a little bit there, so there's no point in sharpening at the same angle. Uh, chopping it at different angles, so we're just going to reset because um, this bar does move up and down a little bit. Um, so we're just going to reset uh, and then just go from there. Okay, so I think this knife is now knife, nice and sharp, um, so I'm just going to, uh, to run out on a quick paper test and see how it holds up uh, compared to previous. Okay, so same sheet of paper. Feels much smoother. So yeah, um, that is the, the KK Moon knife sharpening kit. Um, worked on the the Packer uh, seven inch blade that I got from the knife warehouse. Um, definitely brought out a much more um, a much more polished edge on the knife. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to to look into different knife sharpening techniques. So I'm going to get myself a uh, a bench grinder as well, so we can get this knife polished up on there. See if that makes any difference at all as well. Uh, I think it will. Um, just with the the amount of sheer rotation. Uh, of the bl of the actual uh, grinder and, and polisher um, should bring it out a lot better. Um, but as it stands, um, the the KK Moon did a really good job. Uh, got the knife nice and sharp compared to how it as it was. Um, so yeah, we'll uh, we'll see you in the next video.